So this is the first question in this paper and uh, you are told uh, element A has a mass number 40 and 21 neutrons. Uh, part A, write the electronic arrangement of element A. Now, we know an atom consists of uh, neutrons, protons and electrons. Uh, the mass number is the sum of the neutrons and the uh, and the electrons so we say uh, electrons equals the number of protons and in this case the number of protons we say uh, this is equals to 40 uh, you minus 21 so that will give you 19 once you get number 19 what is the uh, electronic uh, electron arrangement of A? So what you see is uh, the arrangement. Uh, so we can say arrangement here. Uh, how th this is uh, you are required to express how the electrons are arranged in uh, in the atom. And the normally what we say is that we start with the two. The first uh, orbital level has two electrons. So you take 19, can just do it here. You subtract two. Uh, then you have, this is 17. The next level is eight orbital level. Uh, so that you, you minus eight there, you will be left with uh, nine. So you get another eight for the next level. You subtract, you have one. So the other one, we, ha we only have one electron that is remaining. So that is the electronic arrangement of, uh, of element A. Remember the diagram that you are drawing, showing the, elect uh, the, the, the electron, the first one you have to, uh, I think you did this in form two. So the second one has eight on and on. These are the ones that we are referring to as orbital levels. Uh, then part A, Part B of the question, give the formula for of the compound formed when electron A react with sulfur. Uh, sulfur is equal to 16. So what you, you need to, to have here or to know is a valency of uh, sulfur. And uh, what you have here is uh, we have a valency for A, that is uh, we have A, the valency is 1. Uh, we are talking of valency. Uh, what it means is that uh, A, in element A, we lose one electron. What about sulfur? Sulfur, uh, you can see here if we uh, the electronic arrangement of sulfur, we have 16, we have 2, so we have uh, this is uh, 14, then we have 8, uh, what we have, uh, we have 6 there. So it means sulfur is supposed to gain uh, two, er two electrons to make it uh, for the compound to be stable. So the, the valency of alpha is 6. So what we do here, are uh, not 6 but 2, uh, that is uh, the, the, the electrons that will be gained by sulfur. And uh, what we do then is we put S there, we put S here. Uh, we cross multiply, the, the, we, we, we interchange the valency of uh, A is 1 and the valency of sulfur is 2. So this means that the compound that will be formed is uh, A, 2, and we have sulfur. This is A sulfide. Uh, rather, if you look at the uh, terms of electron, electron uh, arrangement, uh, we see that uh, since we have A is supposed to is to lose one electron and this S sulfur is to gain two electrons. So you can see that now we have two atoms of A combining with one atom of sulfur. So that's how you get that. And by doing that, then you have a total of two marks. So that's the way uh, that question is supposed to be answered. And I hope you have followed that. Let's go to question number two.